Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andres Santa Maria. I am a real estate agent here in Central Florida. And today we are touring this beautiful home in St. Cloud, Florida. The zip code is 34772. This house is located in a 1.29 acre lot. It has their own water well system and it has a septic tank as well. So you're not connected to the grid. Uh, it's just missing the solar panels. The address for this house is 3730 in uh, Kissimmee Park Road. Again, here in uh, Sand Cloud. Uh, this is a five bedroom, three bathroom house. And the total square footage is 4,318. So it has a three car garage. This garage right here is a pass through garage. So you go in this side and you can go uh, out on the other side. I will show you later in the video how it works, which is a very luxurious uh, feature about this house. So as you can see, you have a road in the back of the house so that you can park your boat right on the back. And we are very close to the boat ramp in Lake Toho. It's a very nice uh, and convenient location. If you like fishing, you can have your own boat or RV park here on the side of the house. We're also very close to the Florida's Turnpike. We're only four minutes away from that highway, 2.4 miles away. So you're close to almost everything. Uh, there's a lot of new construction going on here in this area. So it's, it's growing. You can see here, right next door, they're building a brand new house also. And these are houses located in uh, more than one acre lots. They're very comfortable and luxurious homes. And you're not far that far away from everything else. This is the other garage door. As you saw on the other side of the house, you have um, access as well. So you can go in or out through this door, depending on the directions you put the car in. But it is very convenient. As I said before, the house has its own uh, water well. Here is the access to the well. The house was built in the year 2000 and the taxes are only $6,277 as for year 2022. Now let's go and see the inside. As soon as you walk into the house, you will find to the left, the formal dining room area. And right here will be this open floor plan for the family room or formal living room area. We have a small bar space right here. The 
kitchen has been recently renovated, so all the cabinets and quartz countertops are brand new. You have a double refrigerator, double oven. double sinks, all appliances are brand new, you have this nice space for your breakfast nook with three windows that will look into the backyard, you have lots of natural light coming in, I like how they have this ones in light gray and the other words, the other ones are white and dark gray here as well. So it looks very, very modern. Here will be the pantry area. And if you continue to this side, you will find the master bedroom. which has access to the backyard as well. And it has two walk-in closets. This will be the master bedroom bathroom again quartz countertops brand new vanities we have a small closet on this area Right here you have the second walk-in closet. Which I think this one is bigger than the other one. Here you have more space for storage. Another closet. Right here you have the laundry room. You have another closet right here. continue to the hallway, here you will find a bonus room, this room is about 35 feet deep and about 10 feet wide, this door you have access to the attic, Here's some storage space under the stairs. And this will be the three car garage. Which has already built this structure so you can put a car right here and put some stuff above for additional storage. So this will be the door that will be the in and out access so that you can very conveniently drive by.
here in this area you will have the two AC units. You have a gas tank, water heater. So this is a built-in central cleaning system to clean the air of the house. And here you have another door to access the exterior of the house. You have here the two electrical panels. And now we're going to go to the right side or right wing of the house where we can find the other bedrooms. So right here it will be bedroom number two. As you can see you have the closet. shelves that you can use and it has a decoration on the ceiling. This will be bedroom number three. These uh, two bedrooms are facing the front of the house. Here you have uh, bathroom number two. Bedroom number four. It has a small walk-in closet. water heater in this closet. And right here you will find more um, cabinets for storage space. And you will find here bedroom number five, which is the smallest bedroom on the house. guests uh, bedroom and you have a complete bathroom right here and this door will be the one you can use to access the back of the house you have an additional storage closet right here This house is located in a no HOA location so you don't have to worry about uh, having issues with any HOA regulations. I think this is the water pump for the well water system and as you can see here you have a very nice backyard area you have an outdoor kitchen stainless steel kitchen As you can see you have uh, four access to 
get into the backyard, we have this door over here, which is one of the bedrooms. This has access to the bathroom. This is the living room. And this will be the master bedroom. You have enough space to build out a pool. You have a gas fireplace. And the roof was uh, recently replaced as well. This is it guys, so thank you very much for watching the video. I will appreciate if you like it to give me the thumbs up and subscribe to see more videos like this one. See you guys in the next video. Bye bye.